Igazu Falls in Igazu National Park, Argentina. Igazu Falls or Igazu Falls are waterfalls of the Igazu River on the border of the Argentine province of Misenes and the Brazilian state of Paraná. Together, they make up the largest waterfall in the world. The falls divide the river into the upper and lower Igazu. The Igazu River rises near the heart of the city of Curitiba. For most of its course, the river flows through Brazil, however, most of the falls are on the Argentine side. Below its confluence with the San Antonio River, the Igazu River forms the border between Argentina and Brazil. The name Igazu comes from the Guarani or Tupi words Y, I, meaning water, and Asu, Wasu, meaning big. Legend has it that a deity planned to marry a beautiful woman named Npi, who fled with her mortal lover Ta Aroba in a canoe. In a rage, the deity sliced the river, creating the waterfalls and condemning the lovers to an eternal fall. The first European to record the existence of the falls was the Spanish conquistador Alvar Nunes Cabeza de Vaca in 1541. The Igazu National Park, shared between Brazil and Argentina, is one of the main attraction, not only touristically, but also ecological and natural. Millions of people enjoy this impressive natural wonder, supported by UNESCO. But before this place was what we know nowadays, it had a curious story. The origin of the name Igazu comes from the Mbaya Guarani indigenous people, who in the translation into our Spanish, would remain as Agua Grande, Big Water. The reason for the name is self-explanatory. The first person who found Igazu Falls was a Spanish explorer named Alvar Nunes Cabeza de Vaca, who during a journey from what we now know as Asuncion, Paraguay, would encounter the falls, which he would call Saltos del Santa Mary. Later, the first Jesuit missions arrived, today its ruins are an interesting tourist attraction, which made up more than 30 towns distributed in southern Paraguay, Brazil, and the entire province of Misenes. After this, by 1768, the Jesuits would be expelled by the Crown of Spain, and the place would be forgotten. Some time later, Gregorio Lezama, an Argentine businessman and politician, would sell the land because he considered it of low value. In the auction it appeared as a block of jungle that borders several waterfalls. These lands would be acquired by Domingo Ayara Gray in 1907, who would discover the tourist potential of the place, setting up the first hotel and setting up some roads for people to get to know the falls. It is interesting to mention that, in 1901, the first tourist excursion to the area arrived but without positive results since it was difficult to cross the place. One of the participants in this group was Victoria Angre, who thanks to their donation together with Jibaja and Nunes, allowed them to build the first highway from Puerto Igazu, Misenes, Argentina, to Igazu Falls. In 1984, UNESCO declared the Igazu National Park as World Heritage. In 2011, the new Seven Wonders Foundation declared it New Wonder of the World. And finally, in 2013, UNESCO again declared the Igazu National Park as exceptional universal value. Due to the cultural and natural importance of this area. Location of Igazu Falls Igazu Falls are in the continent of South America, and as we mentioned, it is shared by two countries, Argentina and Brazil. Although Paraguay is nearby, it only shares the river that Igazu Falls feeds, but it is quite far from the falls and cannot even be seen from there. The city in Argentina where the Igazu Falls are located is called Porto Igazu, and in Brazil it is called Foz de Igazu. Both cities are very close to each other, only 16 kilometers from center to center. Igazu Falls on the Argentine side are located 18 km from Puerto Igazu and 29 km from the center of Foz de Igazu. Igazu Falls on the Brazilian side are 27 km from Puerto Igazu, and 29 km from downtown Foz de Igazu. Both cities are very close to each national park, that is why all the excursions that we offer on both sides of the falls can pick up from any hotel in both destinations except in hotels far from the center such as Recanto Cataratas. Igazu Falls in Argentina Igazu Falls on the Argentine side has the largest tourist portion of the national park, 
as it offers several trails and roads to get to know the place. However, in size it is still much smaller than the Brazilian side, since there are 67,720 hectares here, while in Brazil there are 185,262 hectares. Igazu Falls in Brazil Igazu Falls on the Brazilian side, as a national park, was created in 1939, and unlike on the Argentine side, this national park has approximately 180,000 hectares, three times more than the Argentine one. Combined with the Argentine side, the Parque Nacional do Igazu completes the visit with a beautiful panoramic view of the Igazu Falls. Like us and join us at Xtreme Collections for more fun and knowledge.